Welcome to Dave's Cooking Show, and for you today, we have the Cheesy Slut Burger. First thing we have to do is make the Cheesy Slut Sauce. All right, to a pot, you want to melt two tablespoons of butter. Then you want to add uh, two tablespoons of flour, a teaspoon of dry mustard, and a half a teaspoon of cayenne. And you want to stir that around. Again, you want to make this spicy, spicy roux. Okay. That's starting to come together. Time to add a shot of bourbon. And three quarters of a cup, if my dumbass could find it, three quarters of a cup of beer. Make sure you stir while you add the beer, of course. And after you've gotten that kind of all simmered down, settled down, time to add a tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce, or Worcester sauce, or Worcester sauce, whatever, you know the sauce. And now it's time to start adding some cheese. Uh, what I got in here for the first cheese is a nice Monterey Jack, and then a cup of cheddar. And you basically want to just stir this until it melts. You do want to stir it fairly frequently because again, it can burn on the bottom. And finally, you want to add two egg yolks. And then just stir this around till it gets, you know, melted and kind of solid. So. And then uh, just set the sauce aside. Uh, if you want to put it in a slow cooker, that's fine. Um, just turn it on low. But basically, set it aside and occasionally put it over some low heat so it doesn't actually solidify. Basically, if I had to guess, you'd want this the consistency of like, like almost like a frosty, like a malt. Well, you'll see when we're putting the burger together. All right, and as you can see here, we got three third pound patties. And you just season these up with whatever burger seasoning you like. Again, I'm using the standard uh, prime rib seasoning that I get from my local grocery store. It's made in-house, and it's, <laughs> I really like it, so... Then after about three to four to five minutes, time to flip and make sure you screw that up. And look at that crust. Beautiful. All right. Give these another couple of minutes. Make sure they're 160 in the center and time for the next step. Okay. Time to assemble the burger. As you can see, I've got lettuce on the bottom bun. There's our patty. I did uh, melt some Swiss on top of it. You can see I've got some mayo on the top bun here. You want to dollop that uh, cheesy slut sauce that we made. And of course, we got to add some pickles. In hindsight, I wish I'd have put the pickles on the top bun, but fuck it. And some French's fried onions. Put the top bun on the top, and that's it. The cheesy slut burger. Done.